so I What is this? What does this look like? It just looks like branched hair. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Macro J, where all things are. Mm. Cut the cameras. We do. Hey guys, welcome back to Macro J, where we do all things microbiology. So today we're gonna look at what we can find in pond water. I went to my neighborhood, like little forest and it was a few ponds there and I just took a sample. There was a creek deeper in the forest where I took a sample, but we got some fun samples so I'm excited to see what we can see in them. So I'm going to prepare my slides. So first things first, I'm going to test the still water pond, which is in these Gatorade bottles. So when I took the samples, I tried to make sure to get some sediment and some algae because those are where most of the microbes were being. Um, there's not many microbes on the surface of the water. You have to, you know, you gotta get in there. You gotta get in the sediment. You gotta, you gotta touch the nasty stuff. Let me get my slides, my M scope slides. I have these plastic transfer pipettes. Got these from Amazon. I got everything from Amazon, pretty much. I'm trying to stop. I'm trying to support black businesses, but you know. So I'm going to take my transfer pipettes. I'm going to take my transfer pipettes. And then with my slide. I'm not going to use gloves because it's pond water. So we should be fine. I have my plastic pipette tip and I'm going to squeeze and kind of disturb the sediment that's at the bottom. And then I'm going to take a sample from the bottom of the, make sure I have like something in there, something floating. Then I'm going to squeeze onto the slide and do like Three drops should be fine. Squeeze the rest in there. And then take my slide onto, carefully take my slide onto my microscope. I'm gonna try to see what I can see without a cover slip. And if it's too much movement, I can see movement already. Oh my gosh, can y'all see that? Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna take my slide and push it onto the stage and clip it with the stage clip. I'm going to attach my phone. Okay. So it's focused on my phone. Ooh, there we go. Let's see what we can see here. Okay. It's a little shaky, but let's see what we can see here. <gasps> What's that? You see that moving in the background? What is that? Hold on, let me try to start moving. What is that? What is that? It's moving every time I'm, I'm, I gotta put my, uh, I gotta try to put the cover up. Let's try to go to the 10X to see what we can see. It keeps moving. Okay, there it goes. Let's see if we can catch it. So it's moving because it's a drop, and every time I move, yeah, I'm gonna put a cover slip on because it's moving too much. <gasps> okay. <gasps> look, look, look! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <gasps> Where'd it go? Where'd it go? It's moving so fast. What is that? It's still moving so fast even with the cover slip. Isn't that crazy? It looks like it has eggs on it. And it's just like floating and twirling. It doesn't seem like it's going in a particular direction. It's just like, it's just like, just glad minus his business. They're looking. 
there it goes again. It looks like it has an egg sac. And it's just kind of floating around. It's hard to keep moving, like stop moving so I can see you. Let's try to go to 10x, see if we can closer look. <gasps> you see it? Yeah, it looks, you see the opening? That's definitely a rotifer. fur. It must be eating. So you see the opening, it's kind of like sucking in. So it kind of goes through. So you see like the thing moving inside of it. So look at, it's like, it's like a filter feeder. You can see all the tiny particles being sucked in. So crazy. What is that? Is, is it real? What is that? That looks like a water bear so I see the black thing I think it's stuck because of the cover slip oh, look at it the black thing must be the eyes it still looks alive still kind of moving oh, I wish I could pick up the cover slide but I don't want to I don't want to disrupt it Let's see what else we can see <gasps> what is that I don't know what that is. It's just like circling. I think it's a filter feeder too, so it must be a rotifer also, maybe. Wow, look at look at that. It is a rotifer. Look at look at it sucking. Look at it filtering the food that's around. And it's just circling and circling. Look at the outside. Look at the structure on the outside. It kind of looks like a snail. Look at it stick out. It's kind of, it's kind of gross. I think this is also a roll of fur, maybe? Let's, let's get a closer look. Yes, look at this. Look at it. Look at it filter feed. Look at those little... I don't know what to call those. Those are kind of like motors as it sucks in stuff to eat. Look at it. It's like towards it's like towards me, like towards the cover slip. I'm trying to eat. So we saw a lot of things from the pond today. But I wanted to try and see if we could find some water rest. I'm going to let my moss rehydrate for 12 hours. And when I check back in tomorrow, we'll see if we see any water bears. Hey guys, we're back 24 hours later. And so my moss has been marinating in water for about 24 hours. And we're gonna see if we can see any new creatures in the microscope. So I think you know the drill by now. Um, I'm gonna attach my phone. What is this? Is this also, this is at four times. So I mean, this is pretty big. I'm trying to see. It's not, it didn't eat that thing, so I guess it's not a. This is in your pond water, by the way. So whenever you drink, you know, pond water, this is this is what you're swallowing. <laughs> Physically, I can see that there is like a worm type thing. Let's see if we can see it close up. I'm scared what I'm gonna see. No lie, I'm scared what this is. Okay, I think that's it. No, that's not it. That's not it. <gasps> oh my goodness. Okay, that is a whole worm. 
Look at the face. Look at the eyes. Look at the eyes. Look at the head. You got these little. <gasps> Bruh. Oh my goodness. It looks transparent when you look at it on the side, but close up. It looks. Look at the thing on his butt. It looks like. It looks like a little like. It looks like. What is this? What does this look like? It just looks like branched hair. <laughs> but look at it. Did he eat something on the inside? I think that's just the esophagus, but like, look at it. Look at it, like. This is in pond water, so if you want to drink some pond water, you know, just know that Remy is in there. It might sense the light from the microscope, so that's why it's probably not it probably doesn't want to be seen. Look at this. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I don't know what that is. It might be a water flea or I'm not sure what that is. I put a piece of algae. Um, Cause that's where a lot of, there are so many things right here. I don't know what they are. Are they paramecium? Did I finally find paramecia? What is that? So I put a piece of algae because that's where, you know, a lot of microbes eat. And there's so many things right here. I don't know if these are paramecia. They kind of look like it. But. <laughs> Y'all, I am like overwhelmed with how much life is in this. Like, what is that? It's like a, it looks like a flea or like a tick. And it's eating, or well, I don't know, it's just walking across the piece of algae right here. It kind of looks like a ladybugish. Look at it. It have like spots on it. Look at it. That's a little shrimp thing that keep jumping everywhere. It has like little, it has like, is that the eyes? The little red, two red things? It look like it's breathing. You see the thing on the inside that's moving up and down? Let's see what else we have. Look at that, look at it go. Look at it move, like what? <gasps> Bruh. <laughs> Look how hard it is moving. I don't know, that's a little too aggressive. We gonna move, we gonna move away from that. I don't know, palm water might have to be a series because there is a lot in here. There is a lot in, there's a lot going on in here that I was not ready for. These little black things look like eggs. I don't know what eggs for what. I don't know, but but thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a new appreciation for these small microbes that are living in drops of water, like little drops of water. Um, I would definitely have to do the pond water again because I'm sure there is plenty more life in pond water. Um, please like and subscribe and let me know what to look at next. <laughs> Period.
appreciate it. <laughs>